Hello everyone, welcome to Akash Institute. In this new video series, we are discussing the different counselling processes of the states and UTs of India for NEET 2024. Today, we are going to discuss Andaman and Nicoba Islands. We are going to talk about seat matrix, cut of analysis and the entire counselling process. You can visit this website for more information on the same. Let's first look at the MBBS seat matrix of Andaman Nicobar Island. As you can see, there is only one college at Port Blair. It has 114 seats in it. Now, we will talk about the quota categories in that college. There are three quotas, All India quota, under which there are 17 seats, EWS quota, which has 10 seats, UT quota, which has 87 seats in it. If we talk about fees, you will have to pay approximately 80,000 per annum in this college. Now, we will talk about the 2023 cutoff rank of that college. This was for General, AWS, SC, ST, and OBC. Now, let's Try to see the steps in the counselling process of the college in Andaman and Nicobar Islands. It starts with online registration. The link has been given. Then, combined merit list of eligible candidates for counselling is published. Next, choice filling. Next, allotment of seats. And then in the end, you report at the allotted college. Now, we will talk about eligibility criteria. If you are looking for the seats reserved for the localites of Andaman and Nicobar Islands, you should have the permanent residential certificate of Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Now let's see the documents which you require for counselling. First, qualifying examination mark sheet and certificates 10th and 12th. Neat UG mark sheet, domicile certificate if applicable, category certificate if applicable, PWD certificate if applicable, passport size photographs and government identity proof. Now what about scholarship? Yes, there is scholarship under post matric scholarship scheme. For whom? For OBC and EBC. What is the requirement? The total family annual income is to be less than or equal to 2.5 lakh rupees per annum. You can visit this website to get more information on the same. Now we will see the nature of service bond in this UT. There is one year of service bond that means after completing the medical course you will have to serve this UT for one year or you will have to pay 10 lakh rupees as penalty. So we have come to the end of this video. Hope you understood the counselling process of Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Thank you very much for watching.